What paper was it in? Why? Do you want to order a copy? Ha! I was just curious, that's all. It was in some back issue of the evening paper that anybody could have seen, like the dentist's office or find it in a recycling box, like I did. Our friends and family, isn't it weird that no one said anything? Maybe they did see it. No. No, why? Why wouldn't? I'm saying they could have. It's possible. No, my brother would have. Even our next door neighbors, someone, I mean, look at you. Look what you're doing. I see the fireworks and. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> you're not even going to deny it? No. No. I wasn't expecting that. Well, isn't it obvious? It's me doing that. So no, I can't deny it. Okay. Well, as long as we're clear about what we're talking about. Do you even? What is it that you want? Do you even feel bad? No, not really. I mean, this is a legitimate question for me. I, you asked for your freedom, and so I, I bent over backwards, making sure that, that you had it. And then, and then there was something else. There was. The spark was gone, isn't that what you said? Something like that? I just wasn't enough for you? Why do you do this to yourself? And now? When you're with someone, why? I don't... I don't know. I just... I found this picture, and I've been carrying it around, and I just... I just need to know... How long were we together? That's not... That's not what I'm talking about. I'm trying to ask you something. How long? Five. Five years, almost. Okay, fine. Five years. What does that tell you? That's, I don't fucking know. Why don't you tell me? It's me in that picture, yes. I'm kissing someone, yes. Four years ago. How about you try saying sorry to me? How about that? How about, I'm so, so fucking sorry for being a complete and utter asshole to you during our time together. Why don't you try that on for size? If that will make you feel better, then yes. I'm sorry. You don't mean that. You've never been sorry for anything in your life, have you? No. That's awful. Well, at least it's not sociopathic. I did go to a therapist and they reassured me it's just plain old narcissism. Look, I've been trying to live my life as honest as I can without anyone getting involved in the crossfire I know I was not a good partner to you. Huh. No, you weren't. I just said that. Okay, but well, it's a little hard for me to comprehend all of this because a person that I cared about, that I loved, I loved you, you know, was so brazenly living this, this other life for years and years and years. What do you want from me? A pint of blood? I mean, geez, come on, be a fucking adult. Tell me 
what it is you need. God, I hate you, you know? I absolutely fucking hate you, and yet I still want to be with you. I'm not going to ask you how you feel. So don't. I'm with someone else. And I just... I still miss... I still want to kiss you. I... I think you should go. I, I, I have, I have somewhere to be at, at four. <gasps> Will you meet me at my hotel room later? You don't, you don't have to answer. But, um, 